What was it like, Jimmy? Fighting them Zerg? All the scrapes we were in back in the day, all the narrow escapes, none of it compares to how terrible they are, Tychus. You don't know what real fear is until you got a thousand of these sons of bitches barreling down on you. What's this? I heard them Zerg got burned out by them creepy Protoss a few years back. It's been four years, and they're still finding burrowed dens out in the wastelands. Well, a trophy like that's gotta fetch a good price on a black market. Up for some hunting, partner? Knock yourself out, Tychus. Me? I've hunted enough Zerg for two lifetimes. Have to say, Jimmy, you turned into a real impressive fighter. If I was old Mainsk, I'd be running scared for me, too. You really mean that, Tychus? Nah, I was just kidding. <laughs> Didn't the Magistrate here know he was hiring an arch-criminal as his marshal? <laughs> he was counting on it. Guess my tough guy reputation kept things nice and quiet around here. All the time I wore that badge, I never had to shoot anybody. Well, where's the fun in that? So who's your mysterious buyer, Tychus? Who are we supposed to hand this artifact over to? A bunch of eggheads I ran into called the Mobius Foundation. Mobius? They're a legitimate research group. Why the hell are they talking to you? Soon as your boy Mansk made it illegal to trade in alien goods, they got desperate. And you know me, Jimmy. I am a great patron of the sciences. Thanks for staying with us. Let's go now to Kate Lockwell with an update on Jim Rayner's violent uprising. Thanks, Donnie. Rayner's clearly widening his list of targets. He's attacked a Dominion archaeological dig and possibly seized a dangerous alien artifact. Emperor Mengsk spoke on this subject earlier today. There's no telling what kind of habit these supposedly innocuous relics might wreak upon our worlds. Anyone found in possession of these items will be dealt with to the fullest extent of the law. Look on the bright side, partner. You're a wanted man either way. Thanks, Tigus. Shocking, Kate. I imagine civilian casualties were high as a result of Rayner's terrorist actions. Actually, the only civilian deaths appear to be collateral damage from overzealous Dominion security forces. Uh, thanks, Kate. You heard it here first. Jim Rayner, killing women and children on Marsara. <laughs>